guys welcome back to my channel <coughs> that was a little weird sorry um welcome back um welcome back to build the last i think three days the last three videos i posted would have been my let's play for the ranks to riches series hope you guys are enjoying that so far i have got some really good feedback and i'm excited to go back in the game and start playing um i believe there's two more pre-recorded parts of rags to riches and then when i start recording it'll be like live in time in real life kind of thing um and then i probably won't do i'll probably eh, maybe i'll do like two episodes at a time i'm gonna try and only do one episode at a time um that way when you guys like give comments and stuff i can actually incorporate that instead of it being so long and thinking that i neglected you guys um uh, but yeah anyway let's get into the build a bit um i am building something different um kind of like not really but yes at the same time it's a modern exterior uh three bedrooms two bathrooms um so we have the master bedroom and then we have a a girl bedroom or a female sim bedroom or whatever and then in the other bedroom it's a bit bigger and it's the bunk beds i obviously had to use bunk beds i haven't yet so i had to um so yeah i did that uh in my head just for like two teen guys male sims and then one for the single room that it's actually quite a small room um with the one sim in it and I do change some of the windows eventually anyway. But yeah, so it's more of like a modern exterior. It's kind of nice. The bedrooms and bathrooms are on the left side of the build. And on the right side, um, we have the uh, kitchen, living, and dining. So it is a bit smaller. And the outside is going to be like super neutral. And then the whole inside is like super, super, super colorful. I wanted... I feel like I don't use like a lot of like bright colors so I kind of wanted to go like instead of a, a very like classy not even like classy just a very like basic um clean line kind of interior I wanted it to be fun um I had envisioned maybe like some young parents live here uh with their three kids or something like that or I don't really know maybe that this is like their second I've been doing this a lot but maybe this is like their second home so their first home is very like the neutral um home with just I don't know I don't know you guys can kind of play along I didn't really think too much of like about it um I did do like a whole like floor plan on my iPad so I just kind of doodled around with that a bit uh, with color schemes color swatches of things um and then just kind of the floor plan's the exact same um, with the squares and everything. Uh, where I guess the tiles, the tile count, it's the same exact in my uh, on my iPad. So it was just like the interior color swatches. I just had had to like get a feel for it when I was actually in game. Um, get something that was like the closest I could to it, or change my mind if it didn't work out. Um, I guess I can go into like a little bit. This this lot is called. Uh, I'm not going to be able to say it, so I have rice acres? Don't laugh, I don't know. Um, and then it is already up on the gallery, and it's 108,611 simoleons. Um, so once I built it, so the other one didn't go up on the gallery yet. I want to put that up on the gallery. I just keep forgetting every time I'm in-game, but that'll be my next mission when I get in the game um, to do that. Um... And then, yeah, so this one's already up on the gallery. I figured I might as well just, like, put it up. So I don't know, download-wise, if anyone's seen it yet. Got a little, little sneak peek of it. But I just thought, why not? Since, I mean, it's already... You guys, the time you guys will see it, you might already have it. I don't know. It doesn't really matter. But, yeah. Um, so I kind of... I watched... Uh, who was it that I watched? I watched this YouTube video. I'm going to see if I can find it. Um, and this person really inspired me, so I feel like I got a little bit of it, uh, from, I don't know, this whole, like, cabana thing over the pool. It's not necessarily that they did that, because they didn't do that, um, but I kind of got, like, inspired to, like, branch out a bit, but it's nowhere near as branched out as theirs was. Um, sorry, I'm just seeing if I could find that video. Um... 
Hold on. It was a while ago, I guess. Okay, I can't find it. Um, it might have been on my other YouTube account, like my personal one. Um, anyway, I'm going to have to try and find this. Uh, also, I had some issues this week. Um, if you guys follow me on Instagram, then you already know what my struggle was. Um, I will get into that in a second. I think I found the video. Okay, yeah. Marmalade. They posted a large family modern home plus dream kids room no CC. Um, guys, that is 100% worth watching. If you haven't yet, it was super inspiring and like all the things that they were doing in there. Um, making it like so creative and I was like looking at things. I was like, oh my gosh, how do they do this? Um, so everyone's like skill level is obviously like really different. Um, on that was awesome what they did. I, I was obsessed with it. So, I mean, yeah. Um, and then I will get into my issue now. So, when I was after this build, no, 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 before this build, I think, um, I was in my game, I was playing the Let's Play, and I thought it was, like, a bit dark, because it was really, really, really cl uh, cloudy in Newcrest, um, and I was like, this is so dark, like, it was agitating me, and this has always been a problem in my game, I always thought it's been, like, too dark sometimes, um, I mean, like, this video is, like, great, like, this is normal, um, when it's not, like, cloudy or whatever, so, in retrospect, I shouldn't have even, like, minded because it's fine. Like, it looks fine. I'm just being extra. So, I watched um, a video on how to get reshade in my game. And X Urban Sims is who I watched. The tutorial was great. Like, very easy to, like, follow. But she did say in, uh, in the video that if you're computer isn't like can't handle a lot like don't expect like this to work like this will not work um but I was like okay whatever like my computer will handle it and it didn't it didn't at all I downloaded it right um I went into the game and I was like oh my gosh like the game was unreal it was so bright it was absolutely beautiful and um and then I couldn't get like this little pop-up on the top to go away like it was always there and I was getting frustrated and it wouldn't go I tried recording and my computer was like super slow and you could hear like the fan it was like it was like level like a thousand and so I was like okay maybe this isn't good so I tried getting it out of my game I did all the research on how to take it out of your game I thought I deleted the right things I didn't I deleted something else and I I tried opening my game. It wouldn't. I couldn't get it to open anymore. Um, and then at that point, I had to, like, uninstall everything. And it took forever for it to uninstall, like, an hour. So I started panicking. And obviously, my whole thought process, while it was, like, deleting, I was like, oh, my gosh. Rags to riches is going to be gone. Everything's going to be gone. Like, what am I going to do? I'm going to have to restart. I don't want to restart. Although, like, I'm not that far. Anyway, I was just in a huge panic. And then it took four hours of one day to start downloading, like, three packs. And my computer kept freezing and the fan was going. And I was like, I broke my Sims. Like, it's done. How am I going to fix this? This is unfixable. And then I turned my computer off for the night. And then the next morning, I started right away. And after like two hours, it was up and running. So if I learned anything in this process, it's that I should not be downloading Reshade. No, it's my computer's not meant for it. It's a laptop. What was I thinking? Um, yeah, no. Even if I had a desktop at this point, I wouldn't. Nope, I am not going to mess around with it. I can't do it. Can't be can't have this happen to me again. So I learned the hard way. And those of you who follow me on Instagram will know my struggle this week. Um, I'm just happy that I had stuff pre-recorded to put out and this wasn't much of a concern because I'm like a day ahead. Um, editing wise, I'm like more than a day ahead without editing wise, but yeah. So that was my struggle. Um, Anyway, moving on from that nightmare, um, I decided to use the island living cabinets in the kitchen because it's it's different. I was going to use the Parenthood ones, but this kitchen, I hate it, and I still don't like it. It's not ideal for me. 
Um, it, it gets a little bit better when I change the floors. I thought these floors would work. I can't. Maybe like a beach house, even then. They're just so like, like dull. Like there's nothing going on. Um, I totally could have used the cats and dogs one in this color swatch or even the eco lifestyle ones in this swatch. I used the, I ended up using the eco lifestyle ones, the normal swatch that I always use. Typical surprise. Um, yeah, so. I decided to go, sorry if you heard me crack my knuckles, um, I decided to go like the bright blue wallpaper, um, different, I like it, um, makes it more interesting and not the gray walls, I have to get away from the gray walls, I have to use other wallpaper, um, and from now on, before I even place furniture, I'm gonna put wallpaper down, um, and floors, I think, maybe wallpaper first and then floors, and then maybe that'll get me to like branch out of, um, what wallpapers I use. A lot of them, they have like the half trim, um, which is nice. Like the ones that came from like cats and dogs and stuff. I love those. But the problem is if I want to use one with like, with like the wood color instead of like a white or gray, it limits my options on floors. Um, it doesn't have to, but it does. So that's my struggle. Also, I tried not using any CC and I put this TV in and I'm sorry, I totally forgot until I was editing, so, and it's already up on the gallery, so if anyone downloads it, it won't have that in there. Um, you could just put a normal TV up, because that's what I wanted. I don't know why I stopped myself so many times from using custom content until that pic until that TV picture thing. I don't know what I was thinking. Um, and then these base game sofas, I like them. I think they're nice. I like the swatch. I don't use them often, but they're, like, such a good, like, neutral, like, basic. They don't have, like, anything else, like, too fancy going on. Like, some of the sofas in game are just super unrealistic or, like, uncomfortable. These ones actually look comfortable. They look a little stiff, uh, but they, they look more comfortable than a lot of the other ones, so... Um, and then this rug, I love the rug. Uh, my theme was blues, um, yellows... Um, yeah, I think it was just blues and yellows and just kind of like neutrally kind of colors. Nothing like too crazy, but blue and yellow. I did one of the builds a while ago. Um, oh my god, more than a while ago, probably a year ago now. Um, I did a collab with Lex Sims. It's on my channel, probably like further down. It's also on my Instagram. Um, and her Instagram as well. So she did the exterior of the build and I did the interior. Um, the interior of the build, I did like a lot of um, debug or debug, whatever, um, items. And everything was like super yellow, blue, pink, green, like you name it. All the colors were in there. Love that build. Kind of wanted to like go off that one a bit with like the color scheme just because I really loved it when it came together and I was so happy I branched out. But this one's not coming together as well as that one did. Um, so I do need to kind of, like, branch out, I think, a bit without, I just need to stop being so neutral and so scared, it's just, like, the sim, so I just need to, like, really, like, pop the color in there, um, and just not care, if that makes sense. Um, yeah, I totally should have used the other chairs at the table, like, the same ones I used at the bar, uh, or the island, sorry, should have used them, but the wood looks good with the coffee table. I don't know. My thought process is different. Um, also, I did a poll uh, today, I think, or yesterday, one of the days, and I asked what, um, oh gosh, how long do you guys like videos? Like, how long is a good video? How short is it, like, how t is, is like 10, 15 minutes too short? Is 20 minutes a sweet spot? Is 30 minutes good? 35? Like, what do you guys like? Uh, if you guys didn't get the chance to participate in the poll, you guys feel free to comment down below and let me know. Uh, this one's just under 25 minutes with the screenshots in it. Um, it is, this is like, I had to edit a lot and the speed's like pretty high. I think it turned out okay though. Um, the speed's pretty high just because it would have taken like, I think it would have been almost like a 50, 40 minute video. So, um, I did have to cut back quite a lot. Um, but I think 25 minutes is good. But what do you guys think? Comment down below and let me know. Um, so I can actually be able to like put things out that you guys are willing to watch because everyone has like their own opinions and like what they like. For me, I like like a 20 minute video. Um, lately I've been watching, uh, like let's plays. 
I think should be a bit longer, like 35 minutes, but builds, I'm good with like 20 minutes, 25 minutes, but everyone's different. Um, yeah. And then, sorry if you can hear my couch going. Um, I was trying to like readjust. It's super uncomfortable. I also learned how to, this is going to sound terrible. I learned how to rotate the angles of the floor. Um, so I played around with that and I love it. I did that in the kitchen. Um, in the living room, it's going one way and then the kitchen is going the other way. And I think it looks so good. I love that. Every time like another builder has done that, I've been like, how did I do that? Now I figured it out. So now I could do it too. And I like it. I should have Googled that earlier. It's literally a click of a button. So, um, yeah. Um, also if you guys are interested in seeing how like I kind of like do uh the floor plans and stuff like that on my ipad let me know um and i can even like just show you a video of how i do it or i can just insert a screenshot um i just if you guys want i could do that if not and i don't have to i just don't want to put something on the screen you guys don't really care for but it is kind of a fun process um when I'm like bored, I don't necessarily want to play The Sims. I can just start like doodling on my iPad and working on a floor plan. Um, yeah, and then that's like good. I'm not just like getting in the game and just like going. Sometimes just going is good too, though. Um, just kind of depends on. Just I don't know. It just depends. Um, yeah. So we are at. I don't even know. We're at 16 minutes. Um, I always like kind of lose track of what to talk to up about but in my stutter um there is something that i am interested in doing i'm not sure if you guys will be interested in seeing it there is a game a new game out on steam and it's called the tenant it's like um when i was watching one of the tutorials they put it as a it's like the house flipper game and it's like Sims mixed in together. Um, that attracted me. Um, I do want to get it. Probably going to get it. Probably shouldn't get it. Probably I'm going to get it anyway. Um, so if I get that, do you guys or would you guys be interested in a little video on it? I'm not sure. I'm probably going to get it after I do this uh, voiceover and stuff like that. We'll get this all like scheduled to release tomorrow. Um, but if I do get it, would you guys be interested in seeing something like that? Just yes, no, maybe. Um, it looks really good. It looks fun. There was another game that was supposed to be coming out. They keep changing the release date. But it, I don't know if th the thing is, is it's still on Steam. But I don't know if um, this is just like the revised version of the game and they're not releasing the old one anymore. I don't know. But it was called like House Flipper Apartment or House Flipper City or something like that. I like, I've been waiting for this game forever to come out. I keep saying it's going to come out and it hasn't. And now they don't have a release date. I'm sure COVID kind of messed around with that. Um, but now they released this game called The Tenant. And it's pretty much the same exact thing. Um... I really like it. I think you guys would like it too. It's almost like the same kind of deal as Sims and House Slippers. Uh, so, um, and House Slippers is great. I have that. Love that game. And then obviously I love The Sims. So, I know it's like different than The Sims, but if you guys are interested, just comment down below and that, that'll be a poll as well on my Instagram. So, if you guys want to uh, interact with the poll at all, just comment down below or just go down below and read the description um, and then my Instagram and everything's in there. Um... Sorry, I have a sniffles. Um, also, I was kind of thinking, like, the Sims that would live here. This is random, but the posters kind of bring me back. So, the, um, the the other room, the girl room, I envisioned that, like, maybe she's younger. Maybe she's, like, a child. Um, and she's kind of overlooked a lot. Like, her parents, her mom and dad, they don't really, like... They're super into sports, so we're going to say, like, they're a super, like, sport family, and she's not always into it. She tries. She does it because her parents want her to be, um, so she tries hard, to, and she's good at it, but they're, they, like, overlook her all the time, and they, so she always gets, like, the end of the stick. She never gets anything, like, great all the time, and it's always about her brothers, her brothers, her brothers, her brothers, um... But she had, does have the potential, but she just overlooks all the time. And then her brothers, are, they're twin boys. If You don't have to if you don't want to, but I just envisioned that they were like twin boys. And 
Um, they're just like super into sports, they're super smart, like they are everything. Um, and she looks up to them, but she also is angry at them in a sense, just because she wants to be what they are and she tries and she's never noticed like that. So yeah, there's a little dynamic there. Um, if you guys wanted to play that, you could, you don't have to obviously, but that's just like what I envision and yeah, so I think we're just, I think we're all done the, the interior. I skipped over the bathrooms because those are just basic, boring, plain, nothing really going on. Um, yeah, so then the outside, I love the pool area. So we just do um, a set, like a little seat and then we extend the little patio by the master bedroom and then we just add plants and then we're screenshots and we're done um yeah the backyard is like super plain um but again it looks nice if this is a big lot i wasn't sure like how big i would need the lot so there is like one space you guys will see me kind of like go to it a couple times and i was super unsatisfied that this is like such a big space and i was like oh i could do it like a garage or something but then i just I wasn't sure and I feel like if I tried to do anything it might not be like what I envisioned it to be um, and I was also going off like my sketch on my iPad so I was like eh, didn't sketch it out shouldn't do it I don't know um, but yeah it's just behind like that fencing there and then I I just leave it so if you guys wanted to add anything you guys could um, it's kind of like up to you uh, what you guys would want to do. Um, a garage would be a, ne a neat idea or even maybe like a little gym. There's no office in the build so you could put an office. Like you could put the, the possibilities are endless. I just couldn't figure it out. And this was probably already like two and a half, almost like three hours of recording. So I was like kind of done. I didn't think I'd be able to put like maximum effort in it. So I just kind of left it, um, left it for your creativity, we'll say. Um, but yeah, so here I am just adding the like, gardening. Um, I just do like these little shrubs. These shrubs are like so perfect for fencing things in. Um, yeah, I like them. And I just do like, uh, oh, like not a lot of flowers or anything. Like I don't think that they like to do like a lot of maintenance. I think they're just more like chill fun family. They probably travel a lot. They're probably not home a lot. And when they are home, they just want to chill. Like they don't want to be bothered with chores or anything like that. So yeah. And also I was probably just getting like tired of building for so long. Um, it's always so fun. Like when you go into it and you have like so much enthusiasm about it and you're just like, oh my gosh, it's been like two and a half hours I am tired and then you think about editing and then yeah I don't know I'm sure you guys like all feel that you guys probably get that too with the uh, like playing and you're like okay I'm done building now I want to play so and it's nice to have like the rags to riches series now because I'm actually able to like stop and play which is exciting because now I can like look forward to playing. I do have my schedule out. Um, I will start wrapping up the video here though. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. I know I did. So Sundays I have builds. Mondays rags to riches. Tuesdays build. Wednesdays rags to riches. Thursdays build. And Friday and Saturdays are rags to riches. Um, sorry if I said that fast. I'm just trying to wrap it up. Um, if you guys enjoyed today's video or have any other suggestions or anything you guys want to see, make sure you guys comment down below. Um, if you guys want to interact with any of my polls, description has my um, Instagram in. And then yeah, I can't really uh, think of anything else to say. Uh, make sure you guys comment, like, subscribe. And if you guys want to be notified whenever I post, make sure you click the little bell. Um, yeah, so we're wrapping up. It's on the gallery now. Gallery name is also in the description. Hope you guys enjoy the screenshots. Um, I will talk to you guys soon. Bye.